Hello and welcome. Today we are going to talk about something that tend to be common in patients with Parkinson's disease. They don't complain too much about that, but some of them, yes, because could be a very annoying symptoms. We are talking about chronic runny nose. My name is Dr. Sayas. I'm a neurologist specialized in movement disorder. I'm also an internist. The medical term is rhinorrhea. This is how we call runny nose, rhinorrhea. Very common, non-moral symptom in Parkinson's disease. Many patients complain of this problem in the clinic. Approximately 50% of them describe this, this problem. And might be um, severe enough that they would like to have a, a medication for that. And remember, this is, I'm not talking about the runny nose that you have when you have a infection or allergic reaction. Uh, no, I'm talking about secretion from the nose without having any infection or allergic reaction. Why this happened? Well, we are not completely sure, but we think it's because there is some dysfunction with the autonomic system. Autonomic system is the system that controls your secretions, your internal organs. And in Parkinson's disease, it's not working well. So that's why you are more predisposed to have this problem. So if this problem start affecting your life, including your social life, then we can use medication for that. And actually there is a one that we use off label. Um, typically uh, patient respond pretty well to this medication and it's pretty safe. I'm talking about Atrovent, Atrovent. So you will see Atrovent here. So Atrovent is the medication approved by FDA for other conditions, well, runny nose, but related with common cold and seasonal allergies. But sometimes we use in patients with Parkinson's disease for this particular problem. Usually you can use uh, um, uh, one or two sprays in each nostril twice daily, and that might be enough. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you soon, bye.